Okay, in this lesson, we're going to connect circuits to coding to art and design. And we're going to use Makey Makey, Scratch, and Art Class to create a variety of different musical instruments. In my sample, I'm going to show you how to make a guitar. And one of the strategies that I can suggest that my students use is to project the shape that they want onto the board. I did a trumpet in that sample, but I also did my guitar. I'm going to use cardboard for my guitar, but you might use a variety of materials that you have in the, in the uh, Makerspace and Art Classroom. Once you have your shape cut out and made stronger, I painted it. Now I need to add my connector so that the circuits will work. So there's a variety of materials you can use. I decided to use these um, pins that open up, but you could use wire or tinfoil would work really well as for a connector. I want my students to be creative and think of as many different ideas as they can. In this sample, you could create and cut out a singer and a band. You could make drums. There's so many different materials in a classroom that you could use to create different instruments. So be creative. The final part of our project is going to be connecting our musical instruments to sounds that we're going to code. And we're going to code those sounds that are going to match our musical instrument using Scratch. So we're going to go into Scratch and you're going to go create. We want to create a new scratch. Okay, so it's opening up a new project. Now, first thing in my project is I want to have a stage. Now, I'm doing a musical instrument, so I might go over here and I might go to my backdrop and I might go music and see what kind of theater stage I have. But if you're playing a guitar, maybe you want a bedroom or maybe you want to be in the school. So the backdrop is whatever you'd like it to be, really. So I'm going to go with the lights. I like that one. Now, I don't want this particular character or sprite, so I'm going to delete Scratch, and I'm going to go in. Now, for me, uh, I'm going to show you quickly uh, the guitar. So maybe I want a person who's going to play the guitar. I'm going to take Avery here, and I'm going to put Avery right there. And I'm going to add another sprite, and I want to choose a musical instrument, and I'm going to try to find an electric guitar that might match. So I'm going to put my electric guitar right here. Now I want it in her hands, which means I need to rotate her just a bit. I can do that here, and it's super easy with Scratch. I can just rotate it. I kind of like it like that. So I'm going to put that in her hands right there. So I can also change the size. If I want a little bit bigger, I can change the dimensions a little bit bigger. So now that I have that... I can go over here and I want to look at a couple of things. I want to start with events. Usually start with my coding. I'm going to bring out what's going to happen when I click the go button right here. And maybe she's on a stage. So that makes me think she's performing. So I want some clapping. So I'm going to go into my sounds at the bottom. I'm going to say choose a sound. So I'm searching for a sound and I want clapping. There we go. I can test it. Okay. I like that. I'm going to click on that. And I'm going to go back to my code, and in my sounds, I'm now going to see clapping. And I want them to clap until done. Okay, so let's test. Okay, so it's working. So now what I need to do is I need more events. I need what's going to happen with my Makey Makey when I press the space. What's going to happen when I press right, and I'm going to change these, left. I'm thinking about how many uh, alligator clips I'm going to have on my guitar. So I'm going to go in here and when I push the space bar, and this is going to be up key, down key, and I'm just working quickly here, uh, right key, and let's make this the left key. Now I need some sounds that are going to go with each of those and my electric guitar. So I'm going to go back to my sounds, and I can see already here I've got some sounds for my electric guitar. Let's check. That's the C, E, here's my F, okay, let's see what this one is, and maybe I want a little bit more of a tune, so I'm going to go in here, and all right, so let's go this one, 
and I'm going to have it there and I'm going to go back to my code and I'm going to bring out the sounds. So I'm going to, when I hit the space, no, when I hit the up, it's going to play and it's got all of those choices that I just went through, E. That's easy, let's test. I'm going to go to my up key on my thing, on my device, and every time I push it, it's working. You're going to have to trust me on that. So I'm going to go into here and I'm going to choose, I have E, I'm going to go F, I'm going to go I don't have A yet. I'm going to have A, and I'm going to go in and start a sound. Oops, I want it to play until it's done. And I'm going to go that one. And let's test. So let me test my keys on the keyboard. That's playing, and I want to go back, and I want to add one more kind of sound that I would like to have. Um, I'm going to type in here uh, guitar and see if I can find it. That one. Let's add that to it. So I'm going to go back to my code. And if I pull this one out, when I press the space bar, I should get that. Good. So I've done all of this coding that's going to match my Makey Makey. So when I connect my wires to Makey Makey, I'm going to connect to the space. And then I'm going to have um, a connector on my guitar that's going to hold the alligator clip for each of these. And it's going to connect to the Makey Makey circuit board. So I'm going to make sure that I save this. Save now. Project saved. Now. Oh, I didn't name it, no. Let's call this, always name it, guitar. Okay, now I'm going to save it again. There we go. Now, if I go back and show you some of my stuff, I was playing around with some ideas. I have did a drums. I was working with creating a synthesizer. I love this one that I can see inside. I created a whole orchestra or band so that this, each of these sounds will connect to a different character that I've created. So I've got my spade, got my trumpet. And so I have the whole orchestra with my cardboard cut out and ready to play. Brilliant.